talk about lemons. I've been working on this for some time because uh, lemons are something I'm very interested in. They, they, they provide quite a lot of health benefits and what have you. Unfortunately, here in the Dominican Republic, regular lemons like this one, this isn't a regular lemon, this is a plastic lemon, so this is what I use to describe to people what I'm looking for, aren't available. They're very difficult to grow here for some reason, I don't know. I'm trying to get some seeds and I will be planting some of these. In the meantime, we've got limes. Limes are typically what people use here. But recently, on my journeys, I've discovered that, ah, have a quick look at this pile here. This is a, a surprise that I want to show you guys. This is something that's really, really, really amazing. But I've got it covered up because, of, you know, then it's a surprise anyway. So, building the suspense. Okay. Anyway, so we've got these, these limes. Now, I checked on the internet on Wolf Prime Alpha, and sure enough, limes and lemons are different. They have different properties and therefore presumably different, uh, you know, uh, medicinal or uh, properties as well. So, I sent a, I sent a guy to Nagua on a motocon show the other day, and I said for him to find me a lemon. He came back with this. Now, it looks uh, almost identical to, to, to the lime, but the way you tell the difference between a lemon and a lime is whether it floats or not. And to my surprise, this guy who spent you know, a certain amount of time in Nagua came back with this, and it floats. So I was, wow, okay, maybe, maybe it's a lemon. So I'm waiting for it to go ripe, and then I'll take the seeds and plant it. And these are, these are limes. So anyway, here you can see the difference. They sink like stones, except for that one. Hmm. <laughs> Interesting. Okay, bang goes that theory. Never mind. <laughs> Actually, I should have done this one first. And I look, that floats. No, I'm joking, it's plastic. <laughs> anyway, now for the, the crescendo. This is really amazing. I've discovered something. Some of the old guys here I've been talking to in the Dominican Republic told me about an abundance of different types of fruit and what have you, and an abundance of lemons that they send lemons that they have are much bigger. Now I learned that lemons like this are picked early. These are the ones we get in the supermarkets. These are pick, picked early and therefore they're much smaller than they would grow naturally. Okay, well what do you make of this? Is this a lemon gone mad? I know we're in Jurassic Park and everything's bigger than usual, but that <laughs> is <laughs> kind of amazing, isn't it? Um, I checked on the internet, this is not an ugly fruit because it's too proportional and the colors and the, and the, and the peel are different. This is not a, a pomelo maxima because it's, it's, it, it, it's too rough. A pomelo is, is, is a lot smoother. And if you stick your nail in it and you smell this thing, that's a very strong lemon smell. Fantastic. And these ones are re ready to go. These ones are the right version. Anyway, fascinating stuff. I'm waiting for these to go a little bit riper. I'll take the 